Give us a brief history of Tom Kleinlein. A young man who grew up in Long Island, New York, uh, son of a Vietnam veteran and a, and a homemaker. Uh, had an opportunity to play Division I college athletics at Wake Forest. And really, that's where my, my uh, inspiration came from. I learned the value of uh, college athletics and how it can really transform the lives of, of a young person. I'm a first time college educated person in my family and, and uh, the benefit of being a Division I athlete allowed me to learn that uh, education that you can achieve through college athletics will really transform your, your life for the rest of your, your, your time. Tell us about the Georgia Southern before you came here. Uh, when I came in to, to my role here at Georgia Southern, it was a very passionate fan base. And we had a, an exciting challenge. The challenge we had at that time was that Dr. Keel wanted to move our institution or move our, our, our football program to FBS and, and kind of move our athletic program on a whole up another level. And uh, it was a very interesting, interesting proposition. I, I wanted it to be about a five-year plan. He wanted it to be about a five-minute plan. And so uh, we worked on that and worked on it to where we are right now. What has been the biggest change you've seen? and you've contributed to? Well, I think that, that what I mentioned earlier is just the whole transformation of us having a highly successful football program to making, you know, growing it into a Division One athletic department. Uh, when you look at the things that we provide now in terms of mental health services, in terms of academic care, in terms of uh, services for the well-being of our student athletes, uh, we really go out and, and try to recruit young people to come here and, and say your, your experience here is not only going to be based upon the sport you play and, and the classes you take, but we're going to try to grow you and develop you totally as a person. And that's been a huge, huge investment in our student athletes, and that's been the biggest, biggest change. Uh, part of that investment is the facilities that they play in. And so I think if you look at the uh, seven and a half years we've been here and look at where we were to where we are now, and the vast majority of our student athletes can play, play games on ESPN and their fans and their, and their moms and dads can watch them from home. It's been a big part of the changes and I'm, and I'm proud of our staff and everything that we've done to achieve those things.